archaeologists of the future have given me this. This is a plant bone. It's a bone-like structure, like animal bone, but it's completely made from cellulose and it's grown on a plant. And there are two kinds. This is the single flat leaf one and this is the double crenellated one. It has these little thingies on the top and they grow on sticks and twigs like this. Um, but what they found out is that our successors in the future will be eating meat off of these kind of plants. So meat will be growing, um, plant-based meat will be growing um, on top of these structures. So you can see here an example of how meat will be growing around the twig. So you could actually eat it off the twig like that. Um, and here's an example of a leaf um, that is actually grown with meat. So here you can see it's a twin leaf, so this is the inside and this is how the outside looks like. And maybe it's even more clear if you see this one. They come in various colors, but mainly what is important to know is that the nutritional value of these plant-based meats are the same as real animal meat. Um, and you would actually eat them like that, so your tongue would find all these little ribs and thingies while be eating this plant. And here is the same, uh, but then on a flat single leaf, which looks like that. And the thing is that we don't know how this happens. So we know that this will be eaten in the future, um, but we don't know what happened here. Is it, is it um, a nuclear intervention? Is it maybe uh, a mad scientist that made this, created this, or is it natural evolution that started to merge plants with animals or that started to um, merge animals with plants? Um, or maybe it's a fungi that um, started to copy animals in a certain way. So this is a big mystery. We're trying to unravel it. Uh, in the meanwhile, we can say that we can already create this and have the specific culinary experience of eating plant meat off bones, which um, is an interesting one. Um, but we'll just have to wait for the future and see what will happen and how this will turn out.